Hey guys, watching Volgar's videos. Time to finally crack open this for a beer review. This is the one. Oh, shit. Fuck. Ah. Fuck. This is what happens when you leave a beer in your car for two hours. But it does kind of taste like chocolate milk. This is going to be my crappy beer glass. This is... If you actually watch the video, I want to hear a comment about my Garfield glass. Now I got Guinness all over my fingers. It looks a lot like coffee. Let's get the light. All right. I'm not one who rises to the occasion. <laughs> yeah. Well, there you go. It's got like a man. This is tricky. I should have used a bigger glass. Because I want to drink most of it. I can't. I don't know. See, that's dark. That's a dark beer. I'm holding up to the light. And that's what you get. So, I don't know if it's a good sign or what. Ah, anyway, it's, it's dark. Okay, it's dark. Whoa, I just, wow. This is gonna be the worst beer review I've ever done. On um, probably the best beer. Ah, there, freaking, you don't care what color it is. I don't care what color it is. It could've been a hot pink for I care. I need to freaking drink this. A lazy eye. Great, now my beer's flat. Fuck. I just blew two bucks on this little 15 ounce can. It's not even 15 ounces, look at this. 14.9 ounces. And I can't even give it a good judgment. Now, what I had before was at a bar out of the tap, and it was pretty good, but it, was, it just wasn't used to the, how dark it is, but of course, first time for everything, you're not going to be really used to it. It's interesting. It's dark. What's the uh, percentage? You can see that my finger's white, and that's black. It's like coffee. It kind of tastes like coffee too. I just wish, I wish the can wasn't shaking up. Dang it! The good thing I also bought a rolling rock. Now, uh, technically, I'm not supposed to drink, but I. I don't think it's because I'm on the lithium and whatever, it got problems. But the thing is, I think if I just, this little can, take my time with it, it'll be fine. And what I've read is uh, the worst, or not the worst, but what I've heard that happens when you mix alcohol and, uh, and uh, lithium, it just makes you super drowsy, which is a problem for me because it's hard for me to sleep. Unless I'm like bombed, which is kind of cheating. It doesn't really help you sleep any. You get better at sleeping, just pretty much knocks you out. But you probably already knew that. This is a funky smell. At first whiff, it almost reminds me of a uh, like power bait. I don't know why I'm looking at the screen. I should be looking at the. Yeah, looking at your.
brewed in Dublin. I just can't believe I screwed this up. Two bucks down the shitter. At least it's, I don't know. I don't want to say it tastes garbage after it's after when it's flat, but it's like, you know, nobody wants to drink flat anything. Flat tits, flat beer, flat soda. Oh my god, that's... Never mind. Alright. My iTunes is bugging out. But I play music on VLC. Um, okay. Gin... G-U-N, G-U-I-N. Oh my god. G-U-I-N-N. -N. Finally, drought, Guinness drought, it doesn't say extra cold, it says Guinness drought, pasteurized stout, holy crap there's a lot of Guinness. I'm gonna go with Echinus Drought Extra Cold, even though it doesn't say extra cold on it. Whatever. Uh, 4.2, so not as much as One Rock. Surprisingly, I thought it'd be more. But to review it, it's flat. Ugh. Disappointing. Sucks. I just wanted to test, test, try it out again. I don't know. Sucks. Sucks. Oh man, this is like the worst. Not only, not only did I just. Ruin a can of Guinness that cost me two dollars, and for that two dollars, I could have gotten a 40 of some other crap, but I'm trying to stay away from 40s now. Still, this is a lot of money for a can. I mean, for the same two dollars, got me a 24 ounce of Rolling Rock, and I know Rolling Rock Guinness doesn't even compare to me, I don't care. But a lot of people, a lot of people like Guinness, I guess, I don't know. Holy crap, how long am I in, in this video? I can't tell. I'm in this before I have to poop. <laughs>